computer understands some instructions and these instructions are in binary form that is zeros and ones we call it as machine language or machine code here is the example but programmers can write code in machine language therefore computer scientists created assembly language which was easier to understand to humans here is an example to add two numbers in assembly language but computers can only understand machine language therefore we need assembler the assembler converts assembly language into machine language assembly language is called as low level language because we use low level details example memory location those who already know assembly language understand this better you can google assembly language but assembly language is again tricky and complicated therefore programmers came up with high level languages for example c and c++ are high level languages which are easier because we use english like words and also we never need to take care of memory allocation we just simply create variables and they are automatically saved in our memory but again computer understand machine language therefore the translation from source code to machine code is done by compiler compiler also performs some operations compiler checks the syntax it optimizes our code and generate machine code once machine code is generated it is executed very fast so compilation is faster i hope you are now clear with compiler now let's see interpreter in a compiled language machine code is first generated and then the machine code is executed by cpu or processor but interpreted language is a bit different interpreter directly executes the source code therefore there is no compilation step the interpreter executes the program line by line therefore it is a bit slower but it is platform independent we just need to get our code and interpreter can run it on any platform and this was not possible with compiled language because we were using machine code and here it is the source code you might think that machine code means just zeros and one so how they are different because every operating system has a different architecture so the machine code generated for the same program by two different operating system is not similar so therefore compiled languages like c or c++ are platform dependent i hope now you understand compilation and interpretation perfectly guys all my videos are free we are not a team i'm just a one man doing all this work please hit that like button visit code archery and subscribe don't forget to share and thank you so much for watching my videos